Boomage, what's up everybody? What is up? So in this video, yeah, we're looking for land and we actually end up saving somebody's land from fire. So stay in this video and watch this as it unravels. It's crazy, a crazy day, right? Bad crazy. Boomage, what is up everybody? Um. Got her mouth full. What's <laughs> up everybody? Yeah, we had to stop, get us a little bite to eat chicken sandwich and a little muffin here because we're hungry out here looking for daggum land buddy <laughs> yeah. here we go boomage what do you think about this little spot yeah you guys this is our first stop yeah out looking for land property and this has got a little cleared spot right here at first, and then you can see behind us as I was showing the uh, the woods. Yeah. Yeah, this has got about four acres, it says, 3.75, so. And it's cleared. Well, part of it. Part of it's Maybe cleared. Maybe an acre, maybe an acre's cleared. Yeah. And Bubba back here is taking advantage of it. <laughs> I don't know if you can see Damn. it. Yeah, but yeah, this is, uh, this is our first stop, ain't it, right now? Yes, Out and about. We've been driving uh, for a few hours this morning, and uh, yeah, we're excited. Yeah, let's, just, let's go see what we can find, right? You Boom guys, it. this is totally different. Totally this different. This is raw land everywhere. Yeah. Big trees everywhere. Not even a road cut in on on some spots that I've seen. How many acres was this? I think they said, this is a little bit out of our range, but we still stop and look. But it's about 30 acres. Yeah. Yeah, that would be nice. That'd and you know, nice. you never know. We never know. I mean, we may, you know, be looking for land the rest of our lives. But you know what? That's a good thing to be doing. Yeah, and starting. That's right. When you start something, it's such a blessing to finish what your goal is. Yeah. So 30 acres, uh, beautiful. I'll show you a little bit, guys. Boomage. So, yeah, it's thick. It's thick as thieves. And, hey, it's that time for yurt forecast. Boomage. Go, baby. So, for the yurt forecast out there, guys. Yeah. 56 degrees today. Oh, it's beautiful. It's nice. The blue skies, as you can see. It's and breathtaking. It today. is breathtaking fall weather, and it's and, a good good time to be out. Yeah, and this is our last day of uh, daylight savings uh, times because tomorrow it goes back. So we're taking in all this day, the uh, all we can, and that is the yurt forecast for the yurt nation, guys. Okay, now we've seen some of that property. Uh, we're gonna start heading back. We always love this one road, and so we're gonna go on it. It gets us back into the uh, the county, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's I've been, been, enjoyed been looking for land. I have too. This is exciting stuff, looking for land. And when it's so exciting and your heart's just so pumped. Yes. It's yeah. It is special. So here we go. So, what do you think about that place? I liked it because there's a lot of potential. Yeah, it's raw. I mean, it's raw. Like, you can't even, it's so thick. You're not really going to see much, much walking, I, walking in there. I could just uh, get ideas all day. Yeah, but it's exciting. It's exciting to look for property, y'all. It is. It if y'all's out there pumped. looking for property or thinking about looking for property and thinking about doing off-grid, uh, do it. Don't keep thinking about it. Do, do it. it. Because I'm telling you what, like we said yesterday, if we don't get out of Sparta and start looking for property wherever, wherever, it don't matter, Tennessee, Kentucky, Virginia, Arkansas, yeah. Oklahoma, even. 
right? That's right. Be looking for some land out there in Oklahoma. I mean, get out and find some of that land. Right? Yes, y'all, get out. Hey. We're excited that we we're are excited. doing it. We're excited. We're doing it. And, yes. And I, I just can't express how excited I am. I know. I, it's one of those just you wake up and you're just smiling. Yep. And there's nothing like being off grid. That's right. So guess what? This is what I say to that. Let's kick up some dust. You guys, we've got a fire going on. So guys, I don't know what all Cynthia told you, but we just got off the phone with 911. I recorded for them live. Uh, we come up on somebody on this road they turned around was turning around and as we come up on them they took off there was two or three different fires going i put out one fire but this is the main fire that's still going we've got we've got uh fire department and it's and going down the hill yeah it's spreading going down, down the, the hill spreading officers are coming so we should be able to get this fire contained before it gets out of hand in those evergreens scary this is the fire I put out. As we pulled up on the scene right here, guys, this fire was burning. I had a jug of water for the truck, and we put that one out. So they set out a fire here. And over there. And way on down here, multiple fires were set by somebody. I hope they catch their ass. Wow, y'all, we was out looking for land, right? And found a few little pieces to show y'all, but boy, this is crazy. Oh my gosh, you guys. We just come up on two, on I think it was two people, I don't know for sure, but I did see the vehicle and told the dispatch what I could tell of the vehicle. That's all I know. No, no this license. This is pure this meanness. Is, yeah, bullshit. Yeah, Arsonist. bullshit. like the policemen are using their fire extinguishers to try to get it out this is this is scary y'all now it's spread like they're here now lord help okay you guys um we got some anxiety going on yeah big time tell them what's going on baby with the with the, the person we'll getting... Bring it closer so I don't have to yell. Um, the officers told me this is three times the same area in 24 hours. They got the guy pulled over. Don't know anything other than that. They told us not to approach him. They said, uh, call us if you need us. And they actually told us to turn around and go back the way we came because they don't want, I guess, them people that got pulled over doing it or seeing us i don't know i'm tore up we was looking for land turned into a dead gum saving land looking for land turned into saving somebody's land yep uh so wow wow you guys this is unbelievable boomage so um yeah <laughs> Guys, I'm worn I have, out. I'm tired. We were having such a blast just yeah. going around and, you know. Uh, Seeing some land that we hadn't seen before, you know, and and, uh, and it, now I'm excited because we're looking for land. Denver stopped. And, uh, and then that, we were on, a, I mean, we were coming back into the county. That was like, well, let's go down this road because it's beautiful. Well, I'm glad we did. Because we saved somebody's property. Yes. And that's... So we did all we could do. The law enforcement was there. And then when we left, uh, there was a brush brush uh, truck for the fire department came. Because the volunteer fire department, I don't know if they're shorthanded today. Uh, and the other uh, fire hall out in that area, they were having service work, I think, done. So I don't know. But... Um, Three times in 24 hours. Wow. I'm just glad we were there. Me too. 
So yeah. See, see, the thing is, you keep on doing wrong and wrong and wrong. Oh yeah. You'll pay the consequences. Yeah. And. You sure will. That broke my heart. That broke my heart. That somebody. Just would even think to do that. I know. And. But they did. And they did. You guys, listen. Friday. Uh, tomorrow's Saturday. We'd love to see everybody uh, join us on our Saturday Night Live. We'll talk more about uh, what directions and where we're going to be going and looking for more property and land on the live tomorrow night. So I'd love to see you there tomorrow night, 7 p.m. Central. Okay? So we're going to get out of here and uh, soak this all in. <laughs> so peace out. Love you guys. Yeah. We just stopped some arsonists. C and C is on the scene. Yeah. That's right, baby. Man. Oh my goodness, you guys. Um, I would like to say to everybody, to the whole nation, I'll get on my knees and beg. Don't give up. Don't never, ever, ever give up. Yeah. Because. That's right. You're so special, and you're so worth, and you have a purpose. That's right. Don't ever let anyone tell you you don't. That's right. It makes my heart happy that we you do. We've got a purpose, don't we, Bubba? That's right. We're looking for land. That's right. So, um, <laughs> we'll catch you on the next one, guys. Yep. Love you guys. Yeah, yeah. Yurt. Yurt.